Hello everyone, my name is Abear. Today we're going to be taking a look at the F3H2 with the AIM-7Cs again. Um, the TLDR for this airplane is that in a down tier, it's pretty good. Um, in an up tier though, which is gonna be 80% of your games in last video and this video, um, I had an 80% up tier rate. So this, this video I played 11 games, got usable footage in about two. Nine of those games were full up tiers. Uh, two were down tiers. Um, so yeah, the matchmaker is just very unkind and I'll tell you why we have the F5C A10, which are two of the most played premiums in the game for the US. Those are at 10.3. Uh, as far as USSR, you're going to be having the SU-25K, SU-25, which gets the R60M, and the premium version gets the SU-25K, gets the uh, R60MK, which are basically undodgeable aspect missiles, um, unless they just shoot them stupidly. So those are the main ones. China, also, I believe it's China. Yeah, China, you'll see the A5C all the time. Russia, you'll see the SU-25K. You see the MiG-21s, which will absolutely, you know, destroy you. Uh, MiG-21 SMT is very popular as well. Germany also, you'll be running into the MiG-21 MF. Um, you'll be running into the Hunters. It's just not a good BR to play. 9-3 is the ultimate suffering BR for jets. Now, for the US tech tree, F-104 is very good. F-8U-2 is amazing. f 8 is also amazing. Um, so would highly recommend playing these planes. F5E is also a very good airplane. Um, so those are the planes I would recommend playing. Unfortunately, you do kind of need to skip the F3. H2 doesn't get countermeasures. Let me look at this. Does this get countermeasures? It does not get countermeasures. Um, so F100D, when I, uh, I'll finish grinding that and I'll play that soon. Um, but uh, yeah, wouldn't, wouldn't really recommend... Uh, playing the F3H2 Demon. Um, there's some keybinds you'll need. I'll toss them up on the screen now. You'll need uh, select uh, IRST target. You'll need lock radar IRST to target. I have that bound to R. You'll need weapon lock air to air and fire air to air missile. Um, so that's kind of the order of things. You select the target, lock the target, warm up the seeker, and then fire. Um, so yeah, enjoy the footage. Oh yeah, so we'll slap we'll slap the radar out. This thing really likes I don't know, ten somewhere ten to the lower altitudes, you know, ten okay, three thousand meters up to like five thousand meters, or I use feet. Um, you know, twelve to ten to fifteen, sixteen thousand feet, somewhere in here. High altitude it really doesn't do well. The missiles will go farther, but it just doesn't seem to work great. Let's stick it out even farther, but we're not gonna get anything. So as you can see, the radar is not great. 19, we'll go to 93, see if we can get anything. 12 o'clock, nothing. Expand our search a little bit. Looks like we got a full down to here, F-84F. So we may be able to do something. Oh, got somebody. 12 o'clock, 15 clicks out. Cruising on over. 12, we'll warm up the missile. So these, these circles, you want those two circles. There we go, we got maximum lock here or top, I don't know, the words, uh, radar reflectivity. This guy's pulling straight up, so this should be a kind of a freebie here. We'll wait till we're, I don't know, four clicks away, which honestly I should have. This guy is, should be toasted here. Coming right at me. There we go. Dunzo. Cool. And then we'll pop this up. Get this guy. He's nice and slow as well. Lead him. We have two seconds of, of uh, whatchamacallit. Just it flies straight burn time. Right behind this guy. Should be a... Doesn't have any roll rate. If I could aim. Oh, I can't aim. That's unfortunate. And, uh, he's much slower than us. So, try and get some separation. There's a missile coming at me. Should be... Should it, should team kill that guy, actually. Which would be hilarious. Not sure how that didn't team kill him. We are much faster than him now, so we'll just cruise away. And that's kind of the best way to play this airplane, if you can. Um, is to, uh, he's gonna chase me, which is very annoying. That missile actually followed me the whole way. 
Um, you bleed so much speed, you don't want to try and dogfight any, like, the limb five or anything at high altitude, because they will fuck you up pretty bad. Point of language, there's an F-86K chasing me, we don't want to deal with that either. And unfortunately, this is what happens a lot of the time, is people will see you and they'll just want to chase you down and kill you, because they can. <laughs> um, this plane is kind of a freebie, you know, especially F-86, what this guy's doing. So if he does continue to pull, unless I lose the radar here, let's see. It might be, yeah, it's a bad missile. Really bad missile. See, I had already lost this seeker. This guy does have an afterburner. guy might get a missile off on me, which he's going to, but I have enough speed. <coughs> yeah, he should be able to catch me. Oh, somebody else here. J29, now we're just this the magnet. This guy pulls vertical here. Oh, I suck. Okay. Could have him. I reflexively lo radar locked him up. I don't know if he lost his engine there or what, but we could probably now, six minutes of fuel, we could probably kill this G91. He's going to stall here in a second. That F-86K is immediately RTB. This G91's toasted, actually. It's an R3. That's the one you don't want to shoot you because it gets... Uh, there he is, F-100, this F-100 is going to kill me. Roll, roll, roll. Nice roll. Now we use our pretty decent, we're pretty light, so we can kind of throw this thing around. Good thrust to wait. This F-100, unfortunately, is going to be a problem. So he, we're going to try and G-lock him into the ground here. So pull it, pull it, pull it. Good. Those are very difficult missiles to dodge. So it's a good G-lock. He's G-locked into hell, trying to chase me here. Unfortunately, he gets his second missile off. We are kind of screwed. Yeah, there we go. And let's go up. Roll. Dodge. You gotta pull max, max afterburner for that. So he's got no missiles. But unfortunately... Let's go down. Abuse his lack of roll rate. So we've abused, so we've successfully reversal them. Our flaps back out and then smoke him. Unfortunately, I can't aim, which is hilarious. Yeah, we still fucked him up. He's lost his wing, he's flat spinning. <coughs> cool. Thanks for playing. Let's even go. We got 148 rounds, 3 minutes of fuel. I don't know what this limb 5 is doing. He's about to G lock himself. Pull for me? If he pulls for me, I could do this. <laughs> we won't get that F-86K, but he did pull, so that's nice. I go to kill him. He's seen us now, though, and he's just gonna run, and there's nothing we can do to catch him. Unless I hit a really nice shot here. Pop. 76 rounds. I didn't realize... Oh, I, I wasted all my ammo, unfortunately. I got four bullets left. I have to kill him with this shot right here. I didn't think I was going to catch him, so I wasted my ammo. He doesn't know that I have no ammo, though. So. I missed it. Trying to reversal me. We got one minute of fuel. Pull the hell out of here. This is actually maybe one of why he's going to chase me. He's going to kill himself chasing me to the airbase here. Yeah, I didn't think I could catch him, which is why I spammed my ammo, because if I hadn't wasted all my ammo, I absolutely could have killed him there. He's off the afterburner, question mark? He is. So we're gonna try and do this. He's coming around, he's coming around for me. We're gonna just gonna go up. Make it around. Don't G-lock myself here, that would be bad. Unfortunately, our, uh, our 
airfield is AA is Papega now, so he's gonna get a freebie. The air break. Oh, oh, the AA did kill him. Cool. This thing has horrible breaks, so we're going to uh, do a no gear landing. These missiles, they're so they're so heavy. You just want to get rid of them, you know, lob them out, get rid of them. So especially for this map, using these missiles in the city is going to be useless because of the, uh, because of the, uh, whatchamacallit, the buildings and the radar. So this guy is coming straight at us. We'll see if we can get a, a cheeky shot on him as we go up. Um, the missile's going to be so slow is the problem. This is going to be really, really slow. Yeah, Roland, come heads up with me. That'd be perfect. Three clicks. Let's do that. Boom. Have that. Yeah, see, it didn't even work. Too heavy. Missile's too heavy. With the flaps, he's going to be very high energy. This is a really bad fight to take. But he's really, really fast. So I'm just going to point it down. I'm not even going to try and follow him around. Up's raised. Point it down. He's going to burn a lot of speed coming around here. And then we're going to try and G-lock him into the ground here. So how you want to do that is because he just pulled inside, so we want to keep keep him pulling inside. We want to have him pull as many Gs as possible here. So we get nice and low, and we're going to start to pull, start to pull, start to pull, start to pull. And he's going to be so high energy here that we want to keep the rate coming, keep the rate coming, keep the rate coming. We're 90 perpendicular. Keep pulling. Oh, the game's going to finish. Uh, I don't know. It's a close call if he would have G-locked himself there. Because um, that's the classic way to maneuver kill somebody is that. So we'll see. So, in another game, I like to take 20 minutes. I, it's a, a decent amount of fuel. You know, you should you should be lobbing these missiles. Um, don't try and carry them. They're so heavy. You just you don't want to be you don't want to be holding on to them. It kind of degrades your performance. So this is what I'm talking about. Up tier 10 10 10 a 10 latest 10 3 I believe. So full up to your F-82, 10 -0. So this is going to be a very difficult game for us. I'm actually astounded that we kept the... Uh, that we kept the... Uh, so he's using flares only, so he's an idiot. Uh, he's not using chaff. But so you can see he out pulls it. He's, oh, yep. And I've been killed because I wasn't paying attention. Got tunnel vision. That's what not to do. Didn't see him when I pulled, and he's just fast enough. Let's go to the next one. I forgot to start recording. All right, we're on, what is this, uh, Spain. Spain without the S. This looks like a full-up tier. It is a full-up tier. So it's game three first, or game game one went well, full down tier. Game two, full-up tier. Game three, full-up tier. I'm going to widen our scope here a little bit, extend the range out to 93 km. That's kind of what I do at the start of the game. So we already got somebody here, 30 clicks out, 93 km. Lock him up. I'm going to unlock him here just so I can see if there's anybody else in this area. Oh, there's a second one. It's three, three now. So this is going to be the scary thing. So they're going to be much higher than me. So I'll probably go side climb here. Get some extra speed. The problem with the higher altitude guys is... Oh, this guy's coming right at us, though. So, I'm, oh, that's a bot. And the problem with fighting the bots is because they go straight down. And now, these SU-25s, I'm going to dive to the deck. Because if I can get down to the SU-25s, they are they're, these are fodder. They don't have flares. You can kill these things so easily. This thing clicked back in. Get somebody. Let's see if I can tighten this beam. Oops, there we go. Let's see if I can get this SU-25. The thing is, though, if you let them get too close, they will fuck you. So we got this guy coming straight at us. Let's see if we can radar lock him. He's got all aspect. That's a problem, yeah. We need to not be here. This SC-25 is probably going to kill us because he has all aspect missiles. We're going to keep our speed up as much as possible. And we're going to try and G the fuck out of this missile here. So we're much faster than he is. So if he missiles, we're kind of fucked here. He got hit, though. Got to keep my eyes on him because if he missiles, uh, there's not really much I can do. So it doesn't look like he has rudder. I might have survived that. Very luckily. way yeah we got very lucky we survived that so slim five might be able to missile us here momentarily so and radar this guy which i can keep the speed this might be a kill might be 
killable. Now he's gonna pull now. A bunch of people pulling. I'm gonna lob another one. He's gonna if he goes on the ground though, I'm screwed, which he did. I'm gonna pull for this MiG 17. Got him. So the guns do are back to doing a lot of damage, which is nice. The hunter's gonna pull. Which is fine, I'm okay with that. Because that means he's gonna be very low speed. Limb 5 still chasing me. Which is bad. Because he is much faster than me. I don't know if Limb 5... I can't remember if Limb 5 gets missiles or not. If this Jaguar could smoke him, that would be so nice. I'm not going to continue pulling. 17's pulling. Limb 5. So we're in the same situation. Oh, nice. He got missiled by that Jaguar. Very, very nice. So that's what you kind of got to do. Everything's faster. Full up to everything's faster. You know, you kind of need to... Uh, run away and uh, hope one of your teammates comes and saves you. It's actually, that guy did, so we played well there. Hunter's coming back around. MiG-17 is diving. This Hunter to... Hunter's low, very low energy here. We're going to dive. We're going to be looking up with the radar. You never want to be looking down with this radar. No ground collider suppression. We can probably do this, though, because he's very slow. Get him locked up here. He's so slow right now. If we can get a nice lead off, we might be able to kill him here. Let's do it. Boom. Let's see. He's, he's, he's got chaff. He's an, he's an attention payer, as Jube would say. I think that team is coming right at us, so we can just do this. Pull around, get him off us. This hunter is still slow as shit. Might be a freebie here. Yep, freebie. Thanks, buddy. It's a MiG-19, that's a scary plane. It's a MiG-17. I don't know if this MiG-19 had any missiles. If this guy stall climbs here, we don't have IFF. Oh, the guy's getting missiled, which I should just be able to do that. Another MiG-21 climbing. Oh, somebody's behind us. Fuck, the MiG-19 came back. Different MiG-19, actually. It's, I think. Yeah, different MiG-19. Which means we have no elevator now, which kind of sucks. Which means we are pretty dead. So, there's the MiG-19 again. See if we can... There's not really much we can do here. He's going to be able to sit on our six. Unless we air brake. Let's get the air brake out. Hit the flaps. Nope, not going to happen. All right. Uh, another full up tier. I'll see you at the battle. I mean, there's an A6, F5, another F5. He's got his burner on, but, like, I don't know what the... I just don't know what they're doing. You know, I shouldn't be getting this much separation from that F5. I don't know if he's taking max fuel or something. Like, there's... Every airplane has an optimal climbing goal, and U.S. planes are... There's a tip. You go to this... The attitude indicator. If you don't know what the, what the climb speed is, just go to the attitude indicator, and you just... Set that pitch. There you go. Boom. Now you, you're at the optimum climb speed for whatever this plane was designed for. But pro tip for most airplanes, it's, you know, somewhere between 10 and 15 degrees. Most jets anyway. You know. So that's the pro tip of the day with a bear. Thing. And there's a J32. I don't really want to give him the kill, so we'll kill ourselves. This does it. All right, we're on game seven, I believe. So far, five full up tiers, one down tier, which coincidentally was our best game. Let's place your bets. I'm gonna bet full up tier. Let's see it. Oh, full up tier, cool. And it's uh, city again. Always city. This is like our fourth city. And yeah, this is the. You, as you can tell, I'm slowly losing my sanity in this uh, match, in this game, playing this plane. This plane is uh, not particularly good. And uh, this time we're gonna go do some lots of stuff, I guess, because uh, going heads up with MiG 21s just doesn't work. No, that's kind of the main the main issue. With this plane, you just get outclassed by everything. If you're gonna play 9.3, play the F-104. It is superior in every way, you know. And this ja if this Jaguar seriously just continues to chase me, I'm gonna be very, very sad. Cool, and there's a Sayhawk. <sighs> oh yeah. Somebody randomly took off five minutes after the game started. And that pretty much sums up playing this airplane. Guessing it's a full up tier. 
Oh look, it's full up tier. And oh look, it's City for like the fifth time out of, I think we're on nine, game nine, game 10, I'm losing count. This plane is pure pain, don't play it. If you are gonna play it, don't use the Sparrows, they are garbage. This Toasted Ariete is off to the right, see if we can get this guy locked up. And Missile, because he's gonna missile us. Nope, didn't lead it enough. Pull away from his guns, Ming 19's coming now. Ariete's chasing me again. <sighs> Keep the speed, stay alive. At least we've gotten something interesting. Ming 19, cool, can't run from him. Ah, oh, didn't even see that guy. Don't play this plane. 